and welcome back to Inspire Decor Creative. I'm Lynette, I'm the events designer of Inspire Decor Events and I've got such a good one for you today. All right, so as we've gone into spring, we've just left winter or in autumn and we're merging it together. So we're calling it Rustic Blue. All right, so this is a really good one for weddings, any type of celebrations outdoors, in a marquee, it's a beautiful one. So we're gonna start with burlap fabric um, as our table um, fabric that we laid, laid down before we placed this nice round large um, mirror as our main part of the centerpiece. Then I'm gonna use these logs, right? These small round logs, place one at the front, one at the back, and just add a diagonal to each other. Then what I'm gonna do is get these really lovely um, sunflower, these purple with yellow touches on white sunflowers, real ones <laughs> this time. Um, and I'm just gonna place them in the middle of the log. Then using these glasses, usually used for sherry, being resourceful, you just turn them upside down and put it over the flower on top of the, the log, okay? Okay, then I'm gonna use these vases, or glasses, shall I say, and these are usually used for sparkling wine and champagne and so forth. But once again, turn it upside down, but I'm gonna do the opposite angles, all right, diagonally, and just place them there. Then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get two small candles, place one on either side of these two glasses, and then the two big ones I'll do at the back as well. All right, just adjust so that at the right angles and positions. Then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use these alternative color of the purple to white with touches of purple and yellow, sunflowers, and I'm gonna place one at the back with the big candle, right, facing forward. Okay, these flowers are starting to droop a little. And then I'm gonna use this one at the front on the small candle, right in the middle, making sure the candle's still in the middle, and it's safe, making sure the flower's at the front so you can see the detail of the flower, right? And then I'm gonna use these pine cones, and I'm gonna place them around the mirror and around the rest of the candles um, to give the authentic, natural touch that I want and the rustic feel that I want. And um, pine cones are really perfect for that because they're natural as well. And they're a really good um, way of decorating um, the centerpiece. So as you can see, which I'm doing right here. Then what I'm gonna do is use these same white flowers, place one just a touch at the front, and then another one I'm gonna put just on the side of a pine cone. Okay, I'm gonna put one right there. Okay, right just there and then just to kind of round it off to give the natural earthy rustic feel of the outdoors I'm gonna place this gypsy filler right and I'm just gonna place one in the middle just at an angle right and there we have it right the rustic bloom so what you do just light the candles just to finish off this lovely touch of rustic bloom for a wedding, for a party or outdoors, nice barbecue setting if you're making it all glam, all right? So this is a really good way of using different resources in your home and um, your garden and just bringing a really classic, smooth touch to outdoors and but also making it very natural and earthy. And so this is why it's called rustic blue because you've got the rustic elements of the different colors and the pine cones and the fabric but then also you've got the the, the, the sunflowers which bring the bloom and the, the light of the candle all right so this is me lynette this is inspired decor creative and please share like subscribe to my youtube channel please follow and like and share on my Instagram and on my Facebook and please support. If you like this, then say you like it and really appreciate your, your feedback. And once again, this is Rustic Blue. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye.